Hey, welcome back to the channel. So, today's gonna be not really so much talking about actually taking pictures, uh, more of print sales. So, uh, let's see, I've been doing this for two years where I've really gotten serious about taking pictures, you know, photographs with the intent to sell. Um, finding out really quickly that it's tough. It's really hard to sell uh, wildlife photographs. Um, seems like the money's in more uh, weddings and portraits and things like that, which unfortunately I'm not really that interested in at this time. So, uh, but, you know, why do we get into this to begin with? I got into it because I do love taking uh, photographs and I like being out in nature and seeing all the different wildlife. But at the same time, it was like, you know, I'd really like to be able to sell some of these photos so other people can enjoy them uh, as well. Uh, but in the last probably six months where I've kind of pushed it a little bit harder, I think I've sold less than 10. Uh, one um, landscape photography and then the rest have been... Um, Actually, this uh, the ram right over my shoulder here. I've sold the most of those, and and that's about it. Now, I'm what I've tried is I've done the Etsy, and the thing about Etsy is, and you probably know this already, but it is saturated. You could go out and find the rarest uh, animal on earth, take a picture of it, go look at Etsy. And to find out that, guess what? It's not rare. There must have been 300 people over your shoulder taking a picture at the same time because it's all over all over Etsy. So I don't think there's anything on there that hasn't already been there or isn't already there now. And you go to Etsy and you'll see everybody wants to bring their prices down to, I mean, I've seen some where they're selling their, their photos for a dollar. Well, for a dollar, I'm going to keep them. I'll just keep them to myself and I'll show them, you know, share them on Instagram or, or whatever. But I'm damn sure not going to sell them for a dollar. And that's just the kind of market that's that they've got. Um, I've also tried selling on uh, my own website. Not website, but Facebook page that I made separate just for photography. Um, you get a lot of interest. But then when it comes time to actually selling... Nobody wants to actually pay for them. I mean, even if you sell them for twenty, thirty dollars, which I still think is way too cheap, but you know, to get get your foot in the door, as they say, you know, you sometimes people will do that, and I do. I sell to friends and family, and actually, that's where the majority of my pictures have been sold is to friends, family, and coworkers. So, with that being said. Uh, don't get discouraged if that's your goal. You will sell some pictures. It's just not going to be, you know, probably as many as you you really wanted to. Like I said, this, this market is so saturated that no matter what platform you use, it's already got a bunch of people out there. If you've got a good following, uh, get a, your YouTube channel to take off. That could probably help you a little bit. But it just seems like the actual selling of prints, um, those days are all but gone. Um, so what have you guys done that you found that worked? I mean, I know there's there's a lot of separate uh, websites that I see a lot of the, the bigger name wildlife photographers always promote. Um, I won't name any here, but if, if maybe you guys know something that works, uh, we can maybe help each other out because, uh, like I said, I'm struggling. Um, it won't make me stop taking photos, but, you know, it just it makes me wonder what platform is better than another one because the, the, the normal Etsy, Facebook, things like that, um, sounds like that. And what I'm, like I said, what I'm experiencing is that is gone. <laughs> to, to put it bluntly, so, yeah, in the comments, just, you know, leave me some ideas that what you guys have uh, found that have worked. 
um, maybe some other ideas. I, I do have another plan I've got in the works. Uh, I'm not going to reveal that, reveal that quite yet. Um, it may or may not work. I don't know. I'm, I'm willing to try different aspects to, to see what works. So in the meantime, I'll just keep taking pictures and filling up uh, SD cards. And someday, maybe, maybe the uh, print market will come back around. And if it does, I'll have plenty of pictures to pick from. So if uh, uh, you, you like what you're hearing, go ahead and hit that uh, like button. Hear that subscribe button. And uh, I can tell you I've got about three more videos in the works. I just got to get time to actually get them down. Uh, I think I'm going to break my Florida trip down to two just because there's so much going on down there, especially for a wildlife photographer. And then I've got one from local. Um, there was a, I did a real short of it already, you may have seen. And I'll make a, a little longer video of that one. So those are coming up. Um, so just keep an eye out, hit that notification button and let you know, and, uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thank you.